dear students of class 10 in previous class we have started the chapter respiration so previously we have little bit discuss about the respiration in plants today we will start respiration in animals so respiration in lower unicellular animals or organism like amoeba paramecium the exchange of respiratory gases that is oxygen and carbon dioxide occurs through cell membrane by diffusion in lower but multicellular organisms like hydra perform the respiration through diffusion but higher animals have much more requirement of energy and for that the requirement of respiratory gases are much more demand in comparison to the diff uh, diffusion they can obtain or in the process uh, of diffusion they can obtain therefore they have special respiratory organs that have larger surface area through which they fulfill their desire as in human lungs have millions of air sac or alveoli that covers the many times bigger surface area than their body in animals uh, actually there are three types of respiratory organs one is trachea second is gills and third one is uh, lungs insects have a fine system of air tubes running all parts of the body this tube is called trachea some oxygen reaches the tissue through this trachea which is branched inside the body and the inner end is open to reach the oxygen that is known as a spiracle here one thing is remarkable that the exchange of gases not takes place through blood in insects as the insects blood doesn't contains hemoglobin pigment hemoglobin have the capacity to bind the oxygen now next one is gills are the respiratory organs found in aquatic animals which is found in fish and <clears throat> Uh, reptiles birds and mammals have lungs for exchange of gases in respiration now gills aquatic animals utilize the oxygen dissolved in water and a special organ gill absorb this in fish water enters into mouth and passes through the pharynx which is attached to one side of the food pipe and another end with the gill pouch the gill pouch is a flattened bag like structure both side of the head is available the gills are laterally attached with one end and another free end with so many gill lamellae when water passes through the gills the exchange of gases takes place through gills where the blood vessels in the gills absorb the oxygen dissolved in water in terrestrial animals are in need of too much oxygen of atmospheric oxygen for the respiration and for that in vertebrates lungs is available in amphibia respiration takes place not only through lungs also 
they are capable to do with a skin and mouth but in reptiles uh, as snake lizard tortoise uh, and in higher class vertebrates like birds and mammalians respiration takes place through lungs now uh, in next class we will discuss for human respiratory system